You sometimes get a little jealous when you see your man touching other women at the gym. You have many streams of income. You want to get married next year. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tandi Gama. If it's your first time here, then I do hope you stay and hit that subscribe button and become part of the TG Gang family. If you're returning subscriber, then welcome back. Um, so in today's video, I am gonna be doing a true and false. I know you guys have been waiting for this video for quite some time now, and I'm so sorry I took so long to film it. Um, but before we get into those questions, I wanted to give a shout out to today's hair sponsor, which is Divas Wigs. Um, okay, so my wig did come in this little bag over here. So it's Divas Wigs. And I just wanna show you guys how I achieved this hair before we get into the video. So I went ahead and bleached the knots of this wig. The bleach did go over a little bit, but it wasn't too bad. So this is what the knots look like now. Then I went and cut off the lace because this is a five by five closure. So the benefits of this is that you really can wear it clueless. And I just wanted to show you guys in this video. So basically I secured the clips at the back of my head and nothing else then I would want to just make sure that I lay my edges just on the area that the closure ends so you don't really see that this is a closure and then from there on you start styling your hair however you desire I love wearing my hair in loose wavy curls so I prefer to one curl it and this one curler is from Vaudrey um, you can get this online or on take a lot so when you one curl your hair you don't want to make the um, thing the hair you don't want to take little hair you want to take as much hair as possible if you want your waves to be loose and if you want your waves to be tighter you take less hair and hold the hair a little bit longer then once I'm done with this what I like to do is go in with some hairspray the hairspray that I prefer is from Tresemme and it just basically holds your hair a little bit longer throughout the day and this is basically my go-to hairstyle you just want to finger comb your hair to make sure that it gives you the desired style and that is how I achieve this look Okay guys, thank you so much for checking that out. I am gonna be getting straight into the questions now and you can admire my beautiful hair. I absolutely, absolutely love it. This is almost like my signature look. A lot of you guys know I like to wear my hair like this. So if you wanted to know how I achieve this look, I guess now you know. True or false, you're a very kind and sweet person. Jinya, I don't like to say such things about myself, but I really think I am, so I'd say true. Um, you are taller than your man false uh, but I am taller than him when I'm wearing heels okay you only have one sibling true um, Tina is like the only sibling that I have and I think one is enough uh, thank you mom for only giving me one <laughs> you sometimes get a little jealous when you see your man touching other women at the gym false no I don't think I've ever like looked and said oh my gosh why are you touching that person like that because generally like part of his job is stretching people when they hurt themselves so mm, it really doesn't bother me i'm never like i go to the gym to work out and after my session i'm literally like at home i'm not bothered by who's there or what he's doing it's because i don't think he's bothered but what i do about what i do with my job so like it doesn't bother me you prefer strip lashes over individual lashes. True, I have had um, two experiences with strip lash, no, three experiences with strip lashes, and I feel like my eyes are just too sensitive, and also just the work when it they start falling out and it comes to taking them out, there's just too much work. You gave your man a hard time before saying yes to dating him. True, 
isn't that what you're supposed to do with all men like give them a hard time uh i don't think anything should come easy in life so yeah he had to he had to put in the work you wash all your wigs before wearing them true i really love washing them because then i get to see the real texture like this i washed it obviously when it came it was one curled and it looked like this sometimes when you wash a wig you'll notice that um they had colored your hair so it would lose color or you'll notice that it doesn't hold a curl anymore and those curls were i don't know temporary or i don't know how they did it but i prefer washing it so i can see the real texture and see if it stays that way because it wouldn't make sense for me to come here and speak about a wig that i've never washed that might turn into something else after i've washed it and you go buy hair and then you're like hold on but this didn't happen to this girl's wig and that's mainly because i would be wearing or like experiencing the texture of that hair for the first time so i genuinely love washing it i love clean hair and i feel like it's easier to achieve certain looks and styles that i want to achieve when i wash it when you love you love fully true i am a cancerian and cancerians generally just give their all and everything i'd like to think that i can't say much about the other signs because i'd like to speak for myself and i and i don't like speaking for other people or saying how they should act or whatever but generally knowing like i know cancerians like give their all and everything you want to get married next year false i want to get married when i'm ready i want to get married when um my partner is ready I want to get married when it happens so i don't actually have an actual date i just feel like i don't need to like pressure myself into saying this is the date this needs to happen then and whatever and since growing up i've sort of like realized that you know like we all have this picture of when things are supposed to happen when growing up and nothing has really happened that way so i don't like to give myself those sort of like timelines i'm just living you love your neighbors true i really really love you guys you guys are so cool um i'm guessing you love me too you better love me too <laughs> you don't like showing your family on social accounts true i feel that we should respect people and their boundaries and my family is not um like most of the people in my family are not people that actually want to be on social media so that is something that i respect i mean everyone knows in my family that i'm like the person that's always like on like social media and whatever that's why they call me the kim kardashian of family so i respect people like that even in my past relationships people that have felt like they didn't want to be in the public eye i've always respected so yeah I respect my family's decisions. You've tried Roaccutane before and won't be going down that road again. No, I have not. I'm actually going to be going on Accutane for the first time in my life. I've actually tried to avoid it because of the side effects. So basically, that's false, right? False. Um, I've tried to avoid it because of the side effects, but it got to a point whereby I just couldn't anymore. So we are here are you still friends with fungi true um uh i think people tend to ask such questions because when you guys see so much of people's lives on social media you think every interaction that we have should be shared with the public eye but we have so many interactions that we don't put on social media and don't feel like it's important to it's important to have certain moments that are private to yourselves and like you know like just generally like sometimes we're just chilling you know and we don't always feel like everything needs to go in the public eye so just because you don't see someone posting someone doesn't mean that they're not in their life anymore and that's one misconception people have the minute they see someone not posting someone it's like oh my gosh it's done it's like i feel like the minute i stop posting my boyfriend people will be like oh my gosh have you guys broken up could be that we're both like in a different stage in our life where we feel like certain things are just not for the public eye or we don't want to share um so everybody goes through life like situations where you're like okay i don't really need to share everything so yeah you are part malawian true uh, my mother is malawian i've spoken about this so many times and like people always forget but yes i'm part malawian part south african so i am a mixed breed 
you are born in 1994 false i am a 1992 but a lady never shares her age and i just did <laughs> hi tani um the revenue you earn from youtube is already taxed false it is not taxed you as a content creator have to do your own taxes towards the end of the year so it's your responsibility to make sure the tax man doesn't come after you eventually you have many streams of income true i just believe in life that um if you have the opportunity to like go for many different things and try different things instead of resorting to one thing um you should i just feel like life would be difficult if i relied on one stream of income and that is why i have different streams of income but you can pull a proper face beat in less than five minutes false i can't but i definitely can think i can hit the 10 minute mark or 15 minute mark if i could do it in five minutes ah uh, child i would look great every single day um it's really hard to pull off a good face beat in five minutes because there's so much to do I feel like five minutes is sort of like almost trying to perfect your brow or anything like that so if you can do that please teach me so those are all the questions i could answer for now i will be obviously doing another q a on instagram so if you don't follow me on instagram do follow me that's where i like to create like a little pop-up box for you to send me questions whenever i'm getting ready to film these videos so if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up i'd really appreciate it because that means i carry on creating hair content that generally is another stream of income just in case you were wondering so don't forget to hit that like button subscribe and come back so you can check out the next video till the next video much love